I am here to read you guys some terrifying mimic stories that were sent in to me. Now, I'm also going to be sharing another story from this person later this week on my TikTok, but they have had some really bad experiences with this mimic. So, we're going to cover all of them. They're terrifying and you're probably not going to sleep after, but it's fine because like, why, why are you watching my content if you plan on sleeping anyways, you know? So, if you see me looking down, I have it like their whole story on my computer. So, I'm going to try to edit it around so I'm not just doing this the entire time, but we'll see we'll get it Vera 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 no don't knock it down Fury come here come here oh no oh no she's gonna jump and my whole phone's gonna fall I can feel it in my bones okay she got down all right y'all let's get into these terrifying stories also I'm kind of digging this background I may leave it like this for a while until I like set up a space you know what I mean Okay, so this story starts with them and their partner in their bedroom just relaxing and chatting. Well, they decide they are going to get up and go to like the carport kitchen area of their house to have a smoke. Um, so the way their house is set up, they said when you're in their bedroom, you could see down their hallway and see their bathroom door perfectly. So the partner watched our follower get up and walk down the hallway. The partner turns to pick up something. They look back and see our follower go into the bathroom and close the door. So they assume, oh, they'll probably come out whenever they get out of the bathroom. I'm just going to head on outside. So they walk, you know, past the closed bathroom door to head outside. And when they get outside, they are met with our follower sitting there. Um, they freeze, obviously. Their partner absolutely freezes. And the follower makes a joke and they're like, that's not funny you were just in the bathroom so now they're kind of like what well who's in the bathroom like they get up and go check to see who's in the bathroom and of course they open the bathroom door to find no one there and here is another story keep in mind from the same person with just unfortunate luck with these things so the follower falls asleep waiting for their property manager to show up and fix their sink the follower is jolted awake by the slamming of their door so immediately they jump up and go check out their window because they can see the door and they don't see anyone walk outside. So at around this time, they hear their property manager call them from the living room, but they're still standing at the window, right? So they hear their property manager call from their window and they hear the door slam yet again. But they're looking at the window and that door did not move. They stand there for a second trying to process what the heck is happening and then they walk out to their living room to find no one there so sorry so they just assume okay maybe they came in got tired of waiting and left well they go back to their room pick up their phone to see a text from their property manager saying hey something came up can I come tomorrow so there was no one in their house now the property managers actually lived there prior and they said that they believe that they did some strange things in the house um, they actually know of a few things that the property manager told them, but whenever they came in, in one of the bedrooms, there was a few strange drawings. Like, you would look at the drawings and they would look normal, and then you looked closer and something was wrong. Like, there was one drawing of, like, McDonald's fries, like the box, and you look closer at the fries, and it was human fingers. So I'm going to leave you with the final small story that they told me that sent shivers down my spine. One night, their son started screaming from his bedroom, like just absolutely blood curdling screaming. So they run in there to check on him and he is pointing at his closet, screaming repeatedly, it's me, it's me. Because he saw himself standing at the closet door. And that is all for this round of follower stories. Um, like I said in my upload, was it yesterday or the day before? I don't know, the days blur. But um, I'm going to be uploading one either long-winded follower story on here or a bunch from the same person once a week on top of eventually I'm going to start uploading more stuff on here. So be excited for that. I am so excited to start up with YouTube and stick with it and it's going to be fun. Um, I'm kind of digging this background for now. So we're going to keep it for a second. But um, I mean, if we change it up, we change it up. It's fine. But thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys on here next week.